right, tell me now if I was lying. My next guest is only six years old. He's already starred in a film called Losing Isaiah. Recently won the Kids Talent Night with a comedy. The kid's doing stand-up. He's six at the Apollo Theater in New York City. Please welcome my buddy, my pal, Mark John Jeffrey. <laughs> Dennis Rodman glasses, aren't they? Yeah. Well, let me see what you look like with those. Come on, get that hat off there. Here. Here we go. Put that hat over here. There you go. You look good. It's good. Did you get something to eat? Yes. Okay, you were hungry when you got here today, huh? Yeah. What'd you want, pancakes? Nah. I decided when one stayed in the hat, I had two um, sandwiches. Two sandwiches? With, um... What do you call it? Brownies? Uh, yeah, two sandwiches, and brownies. I, and I blow it in the hot. And that was like five minutes ago, wasn't it? I know. I just saw you back there stuffing your face. With um, pineapple, too. And a pineapple, yeah. <laughs> now, you just had a big graduation, I understand, yeah. yes? Yeah. Oh, okay, I'll congratulate you again, yeah. <laughs> now, where did you? On my graduation, I won the reading award, the spelling award. You won the reading award? The math award, the science award, wow. Jeopardy. <laughs> Were you like the only kid in the school, like our Olympian there? <laughs> now, what did you what did you graduate from? Um, kindergarten. Can you, they have kindergarten graduation now, and like valedictorian and all of that. Yeah. Wow! Did you? Oh, I forgot to tell you. Yeah. Um, I I, I got a prize to a you frisbee. Got, you got a frisbee for graduating. Yeah. I think that's what my parents gave me when I graduated too. I got a frisbee. <laughs> Now, what do you like to study? What are your favorite subjects? Um, reading. Reading? Reading's good. Yeah, reading's reading good. books. Yeah, and, and math, too? See, that was hard for me. I'm not good at math. <laughs> yeah? You figured that out, huh? That's why I won the math wood. Yeah, that's why you won, because of people like me. Yeah. <laughs> now, I heard you got a new pet. What'd you get? You got a kitten? You got a dog? A snake. You got a snake? What kind of snake? A ball python, but... Wait, wait, wait. wait a what? A what? A ball python. A ball python? Aren't they huge? No, I, I, I bought mine as a baby. Oh, it's a baby. And a pet, if you just buy it, its yeah. street name is a bull python. Right. But it's, when it's at the house, its name is Burmese python. <laughs> Burmese python. <laughs> now, what, I don't even know. What, what do you feed a python? Um, a snake. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> they, eat, they eat different kind of snakes, yeah. like... Um, they eat other snakes? Yeah. So you, if you put a snake inside a snake? Garden snakes, yeah. Garden snakes. They're too little. Too and they're too skinny. And they're too skinny. So it's like... So that would be like spaghetti to another snake. Yeah. yeah. Now, do you, now, do you feed snakes to your snake? No. Now I feed her mice when she's a baby. You feed a mice? Where do you get mice? From pet shop. Are you going down and you buy... Where we buy, where we buy the snake. Won't the python grow to be bigger than you? No, and then seven he put his, feet. And he puts seven feet. That's right. <laughs> and then they put their arms around. <laughs> he would eat you. No, not not a snake like that. No. But the um. He won't um, eat you, that snake. No. No. He might think you're the a mouse. The other snake that's cool. Um. Do you have a Mickey Mouse hat? If you put a Mickey Mouse hat on and walk in there, he could eat you, thinking you're a mouse. <laughs> have you got a Mickey Mouse hat? Yeah, don't ever wear it near the snake. It's and another snake that was aggressive too, aggressive yeah. for kids. Uh -huh. That was called, um, what is the name? I forgot the name, it's but it's some snake. kind of snake. Now you have a sister. You have a new uh, sister yeah. now? Oh, I have, I have a card of a picture me, of your sister? me and I, me and her, yeah. in my pocket. Okay. Oh. oh, she's very pretty. Let's see, is it you and your sister? Look at that. Very pretty. There you go. Look at that. Aww. Hey, let me ask you one thing. You know why I asked you here? Because yeah. I heard you won this show at the, uh, the kids' show at the Apollo Bay doing the stand-up. You want to be a stand-up comedian? Sure. Yeah, sure, not bad. Yeah. <laughs> now, can you tell us a joke? Sure. All right. All right. The joke is, um, Dad, are you a polar bear? Uh, yes, sir. Am I a polar bear? No, not you. Oh. Dad, are you a polar bear? 
yes, son, that is mommy a polar bear, yes, son, that is grandma a polar bear, yes, son, why? That is grandpa a polar bear, yes, son, why? Because I'm a freezer! Hey, that's pretty good, Joe. Well, that's all right. All right. See, no, no, no. I got to tell you something. Come on, I have to ask you something. Huh? In the morning, when you get up, do you scratch? Because every time when my daddy get up, down into his pants. Scratch, scratch, scratch. He said, hello. Well, I'm sure your dad will be thrilled and that you said, shared that with us. Next, Richard Pryor. It's good to see you. Mark, thank you very much. Mark. <laughs> We're right back with Celine.